Hello friends. So today in this video, we're gonna discuss an interesting problem from lead code, which is a medium level problem. Problem name: insert into a binary search tree. So there can be a number of ways to insert in a binary search tree. But first, we have to understand what is a binary search tree, and uh, if in the simplest term it actually states that a binary search tree is a, like a binary tree in which every node can be have at at max two nodes and the left node value if it exists is smaller than the lead, like the top node or the parent node and the right like the right leaf value or like the right node value is larger so as you can see for every node the the, the left one is smaller and the right one is larger and so on now you have to insert a given value in this binary tree such that the resulting tree should be binary tree now there can be a couple of positions you can insert into a binary tree to even make it a binary tree as you can see this if this is a binary tree and you want to insert 5 the simplest way can be uh, just go to the end of the binary tree using the searching operation what i mean by the searching searching operation is like let's compare the value you want to insert with every node on ur okay so i'll tell you with example but first we're going to see that the node 5 in this example can be inserted at this point and can be inserted at this point also but we're going to insert at this point which is the which is some some sort of a leaf node which will make it easy so as you can see the simplest way can be because you know the property of binary tree in which the left or the right side node is having a value greater and the right on the in the left side node is having a value smaller and that condition is satisfied for every node value so now what you can do if you want to insert 5 you will compare 5 with 4 okay because that's the node from which you will start and you will see that the value which is 5 you want to insert in this tree is greater than 4 which means that you don't have to insert this 5 value on the left side obviously because you have to somehow insert this value on the right side so that when it boils down to some position it should be on the right side because every value which is greater than 4 should be on the right side so you will move down to this node now you cannot insert at this point because you cannot like if there is no node at this point on the right side you just insert right 5 at this point but because there is no node on like there is a node at on the right side of this four you will go to this node now you will compare the value 5 with this node now when you compare 5 with this node you have two options whether you can insert on the left or the right so you have to match 5 with this node now as you can see 5 is smaller than 7 so it is not beneficial to insert on the right side you have to insert on the left side i hope you get the point because see you have to assume or you have to make sure that the value should be on the left side if it is smaller and right side if it is greater because it is a binary search tree and when you see that okay now i have to insert 5 at the left side now whether there is some node on the left side no so just i i can just insert a new node on this new left side and that's answer and as you can see that's answer and that's the simplest logic for this problem you you can do this on a like a recursive way because it is like a searching operation in a log n because you can reach any leaf in a log n like log n combination n is not the number of nodes it's actually the levels okay so number of levels because in each level or like in each step you you go one level down and then uh, you can reach the leaf node in log of n levels now that's the whole problem and as you can see for every uh, like every two you just have to do the same thing so i will tell you with the code part now to even make it more clear so uh, like you can write out the recursive function another recursive function also but i have written down in, in this uh, like the starter function also so what you can see here is i have a root node and a value okay i can even make it bigger so as you can see if root is null which means that the root like the given node the starting root root like the root on a starting root value is null only which means that the, there is no root value so then if the root value is null then the answer is just insert that value at the root value now you want to insert a new node now so you want to insert a new node like this so you want to make a new node of a tree node type insert a value because you have to insert a value at this point it it is just creating a new uh new node and you have to make your root equal to this new node and just return out the node or like actually the root whatever so okay that's the whole first like a base condition but now you have you if you ensure that the root is not null there is some root here you have to compare your root with the value itself if 
the value is greater than the root value as you can see then it means that i can insert this value on the right side if there is no node so i have to ensure that on the right side if there is no node means that the right side is equal to null if the right side is equal to null just insert a new node on the right side but if the right side is not null what you'll do you'll recursively call this function again on the right side i hope you get the point with the same value because you have to insert that value else if the like the value is smaller than the root value and as you can see every value is uh, it is written that every value is original on like it is not repeating so that's why you don't have to carry about or worry about the equal to sign it's just greater than or smaller than so as you can see if it is greater than the value is greater than the root value you just go to the right side if it is smaller than the smaller than the value then you have to go to the left side and then you have to do the same thing you just have to see that okay if this is smaller can i insert a new node on the left side if we can only insert if it is null the left side is null then you can insert it if it is not null what you can do you have to go to the left node and then recursively call this function again and in the end when you have inserted you have to just return out the root value because you are inserting a new node so the tree is not changed you have just inserted so in the end you just have to return out the like return out the original root value i hope you understand the logic and the code the code i will like post this code uh not actually in the description but i will make a like in the description in the in a discussion form i will paste this code and then you can see there okay i hope you understand the logic and the code if you still have any doubts comment around i'll see you next one till then keep coding and bye